can you just talk about the first week of practices so far? Uh, everything's going great. Um, you know, new staff, so everyone's just, you know, still building. Uh, a lot of more family things, you know, come together as one unit. I, I think that goes across, like, the whole, you know, every position, from all line to the D-line. Everyone's, you know, come together. Um, I think more of the team reps really help uh, going against each other competing. So I think that's, like, one big thing that we're progressing to. A few players have told me about the little huddle thing you guys do at the end, but can you just talk about it from your perspective a little bit? Uh, I think it's cool. Um, you get to know each coach. You, ha you have to know each player, each coach where they're from, what school were they at before, if they were a different coach. Um, Player-wise, you get to know where other players are from. I didn't even know we had a coach from Minnesota, so it's pretty cool. You're one of the most seasoned players on this team. You've been through Riley, you've been through Gary, and now you're going through this. So what is that like for you? Um, I think it's, you know, it's preparing me for the next step. I mean, the league is the same. You get traded and do, you know, new coach, new, you know, playbook. But uh, I think it's... Not really much the coach, it's the coaching and how they're preparing us for the next level, for the season, and just, you know, building with the players. Are you being forced into a leadership role, or is that just who you are, or do you want to be a leader on the team um, right now? Yeah, I mean, kind of, it's just more I want to lead by example the best I can. Uh, with some senior guys, you know, me, Gus, uh, Trent, uh, I think it's just more like just try to help the young guys, like, know what to do, where to be, when to do it, so... I've been listening to your coach the last couple of practices, and his leadership style is definitely different than you guys have had in the past. Oh yeah, it's different. Um, I've known Coach Mahalchik since high school, so that was kind of something I expected. Uh, love his style of coaching. Uh, it's more player built, so he understands like where we're coming from and like how we're feeling. So kind of like. It. What is he implementing into you guys right now? Um, first off, I'd say probably you know staying low, mm -hmm. you know using our legs. Everything's technique wise, but. Mainly our legs would be the progression, and then and then on to you know using everything upper body wise and you know, making sure we know our assignments. I heard him say a championship mindset or something along those lines. Uh, yeah. So you know, past couple seasons haven't been going so great, and I think that goes into the preparation of everything we've gone through so far. And I think he wants to build that you know the, the foundation of having a championship mindset at practice, so that we can carry that on to game day or you know fall camp when it comes. What are your goals for spring practices? Just make sure, you know, not only me, but, you know, the whole team knows their plays, knows their assignments, and just, you know, my technique fundamentally sound and just be ready. After last season, where do you want to go this season, and what do you what, what do you want to accomplish? I just want to take Oregon State to, you know, a level that they've never gone to before. Um, I know we're the underdogs in every, you know, every going against every team, so I just want to take that, you know, to the next level. Thank you.